Hey no coders, welcome to another video. In this video, I'm gonna talk about a new update from Bubble. Are you a Bubble user? If you are a Bubble user like myself, you would like to know about this little update from Bubble. Before I jump into the content, I just want to present myself to you real quick. Hi, my name is Kyle. I'm the chief no code officer here at We Are No Code. And if you're new to this channel, here we talk about no code tools, we talk about the no code space, updates, and also we teach you how to launch your startup business idea without being a tech person by using no code tools. So don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this video with a friend. All right, let's talk about the update from Bubble. So Bubble released their new responsive engine last year, right? Now the responsive engine will come out of beta. So what does it mean? Well, right now, if you jump into Bubble, you will see that you have an option to choose if you want to activate the new responsive engine or if you want to keep using the legacy version. What's going to happen after the responsive engine is out of beta is that you will no longer have options to select the old version. All the new apps you create will be created using the new responsive engine by default. I received this email from Bubble. And in this email, they are talking about this change. So by June 27th, they will be replacing the old version with the new responsive engine. And when you create new apps, you will be only able to use the new responsive editor or the new responsive engine. So if you have a bubble application that's not currently using the responsive engine, at some point, it might be good for you to update that. But this change will not affect the existing apps you have. It will only change for new apps. Let me jump into bubble so I can show you in more details. Hey, we have a free toolkit for you to download and get a lot of information about no code tools and also discounts inside. So if you want to download this free toolkit for free, go here down below in the video description section. There is a link for you to download this free toolkit. Okay, I'm inside bubble right now. I just created a new application from scratch. And this is the way the editor looks like right now, exactly when I'm recording this video before the update that I'm talking about. So when you create a new application, you see this little icon here, this responsive icon here. So that means if you start creating anything inside Bubble, the way it is, it will not be using the new responsive engine. And then if you want to use the responsive engine, you have to click this button and upgrade to responsive beta. What's going to change is that once they do that change and once the responsive engine is out of beta, this option will no longer be available. Every time you create a new Bubble application, it will be using the responsive engine by default. So you cannot use the legacy version anymore. And that will happen after June 27th. Also, don't forget to check our free course. We prepared this free course to help you get started in your no-code journey and start creating your online business without being a technical person. So if you wanna learn how to launch your startup business idea, your online business as a non-technical person using no-code tools, go there down below in the video description section. There's a link for you to enroll for free into this free course. So are you using the Bubble Responsive Engine right now? Are you willing to upgrade your existing applications? Also, a quick information for you. Be aware of existing templates in the marketplace because now you want to make sure you buy templates that are compatible with the new responsive engine only because otherwise you would buy a outdated template that will no longer function in the future. So that's not good, right? So try to avoid that and research if that template is actually compatible with the new responsive engine so you make sure that you are buying a template that will survive over time. Time. All right, guys, that's all that I wanted to share with you guys. I hope you liked to know about this little update Bubble is making. I'm really happy that they are moving forward and the new responsive engine will be the default version for everybody because I think it's way better than the old version. And that's good news for all of us using no code tools, right? So thanks for watching so far. I see you on the next videos. Let's no code.